32 teams have Sao Paulo, 10 teams from the three regions, America, EMEA, and Pacific, and two from China, but only one will be the winner of the tournament and the offseason. Which of these rosters will be victorious at Sao Paulo, Brazil? Let's have a look at all 32 teams who will be competing at Locked in Sao Paulo, starting off with the Americas League. Let's start off with 100 Thieves. This team haven't made a whole lot of changes unlike some teams in this video. The team consists of Arsenal, Derek, Stella as the IGL, coming from Exet Cryocells, and, and in the team full time, Bang. The coaches are Mikes and former C9 coach James IRL. While Sean Guess has gone to content creation, and player Will has joined Mad Lions. Some people are saying Cloud9 might be a super team for this year's season in VCT, and who could blame them? This team has signed some high profile players for their run for the VCT trophy. The team consists of Leaf, Zeppa, Vanity as the IGL, former V1 and Sentinels player Zolsus, former Optic player and El Diablo himself Ye, and former Guard Analysis Cupert. The coach is former Guard coach MCE. Curry and coach Vexel are free agents. Mitch has joined Oxygen Esports. Vapen is working with OR Esports. And James IRL is the coach for 100 Thieves. The team which everyone is confused on how this team got into partnership is Evil Geniuses. Even though this team has a rich history at esports, the team has also announced that it will have a 10 man roster for this year. The players consist of Busio, Reformed, Jogimo, Com, Apoth, former NRG player Ethan, former Xset player BCJ, former Swan 2.0 player Demon1, and former Dark Zero player Screwface. Other coaches are Potter, Lynn, and former NRG coach Zigzi. The first Brazilian team for your esports. Just like 100 Thieves, haven't made a whole lot of changes to the roster, but with them adding two new players to the team. The team consists of Quick, Kali, Mazin, Digizin, and former Vivo key player MW0, and former TBK player Conan as a sub. The coach is Kalau. Nosweir has left to, has left the team to join a new team. The best team in Latem is here to play. Curry Sports has made some drastic changes to the roster, gone with the old roster and incoming players from Brazil, Colombia, and Chile. The team consists of Klaus as the IGL, Nags, former NIP player Zand, former Exolius Laser player Davies, former, former Leviathan player Melser, and former Odic player Zeddy. The coach is Li as Liazzo and DDX as the strategic coach. Delzik is a free agent while Mazzino and Kesnet have joined Crew's rival. Speaking of them, Leviathan have, might have a chance to become the best Latin region team with a roster by stealing some key players from Crew. The roster consists of King, Takalila, Shy, former Furia player Nosware, and former Crew players of Mizino and Kesnet. The coach is Onyo. Adverso has joined has joined Double Zero Nation. While Melzer has joined Crew and Coach B Tony is a free agent. The Brazilian powerhouse of our reigning champions, Loud, might struggle with two key players leaving the team to join a, a team you probably weren't expecting. The current roster consists of Aspas, Les, Sardak, former NIP player Kalinzin, and former TBK player Tuzzy. While the coach is former Pioneers coach Frog and former, and former MI, MIBR coach STKJ. Sassi and Pancada have both left to join a new team, while Bazooka has also left to join our next team in the video. A team with a lot of history in esports, MIBR, who might be a mid pack team in this event, but with the support from the Brazilian fans, we might, we might see them at the top. The roster consists of Jay Z, Frozen, former Vivo Key trio of Heat, Murs, and RGL Meister, and former Rise Gaming player Zalzin. The coach is former Loud Coach Bazooka, while Mendes is a free agent. Coach SDKJ have, has left to join the performance in Loud. Denaro has joined TBK Esports, and GTN has joined Red, Can Red Canids. NRG might have a chance to compete with the big teams with their new roster, with a very surprising acquisition from the EMEA region. The roster consists of SOM, Optic Trio of Finesse as the IGL, Crashies, and Victor, former FPX player Ardis, and former T1 player Thwifo. The coach of former Opto coach Shet and former TSM coach Trainer. Tex and coach Josh RT have joined the guard. Ethan and, Z and coach Zixi have both joined the performance in EG. Hayes has joined T has rejoined TSM. And EU has joined the new MAT org. Rare enough, the Americas team is the most classic team in America, Sentinels who has exploded their roster just like NRG to build a scarier and improved team for the season. 
On the roster, we have Tens, former XZ player Zekin, the loud duo of Salsi and Pancata, the other XZ player of Def as the IGL, and Sick, who returns to competitive play. The coaches are former XZ coach Psycho NT and former Ghost Gaming coach Kaplan as the strategic coach. Coach Rockets is a free agent, Zelsus has left to join C9, Dapper and Shazam have both joined G2, and Shroud has also left. One region and 10 teams down. Now, let's go to the EMEA region. Starting in EMEA is one of two Turkish teams. BBL Esports are looking to put Turkey on the map as a region to be reckoned with, and their roster is looking decent for Sao Paulo. The team has Aslan M for Shadow, Keshner X, Turco, former SMB player Brave, former Fireflux Esports player Solchini as the IDL, and returning into the team, Aimdil. The coaches are former Giants coach Vlad and former Parlor Esports coach Epic. While coach Fabro has left, Muge has left to join BBL's rival in Turkey, and Elite, who joined the team briefly during the offseason, has joined Supermassive Blaze, a team who is hungry for victory. Fnatic has built a roster to fear, with some new additions and three players carrying over from last year. The roster includes Boser as the IGL, Durka, Alphaye, former guild player Leo, former Gambit player Chronicle, and former Case Esports player Kamake. The coaches are Mini and SLK who returned to the team after leaving in September 2022. Mystic and Enzo have both joined Apex. The second and last Turkish team is Foot Esports, who has made changes to the roster from last season by adding only one new player. The roster consists of Moj, Kraxus, PW1, Mr. Fallen as the IGL, former Thunderbolt gaming player at the captain, and Muge, who is now on the team full time. The coaches are Guys and former Vivachi Esports coach Nidenag. One of three Spanish orgs, Giants, has rebuilt their whole roster, like how most teams did for the season. The roster consists of Fatino, former G2 duo of Hoodie and Nookie, former Gen G player Rhyme as the IGL, and former Navi player Cloud, while the coach is former G2 coach Pipson. Shadow has joined Apex, Jesse has joined Valiant, Kellis has joined Case Esports, Russ has joined S2G Esports, Coach Vlad has joined BBO as mentioned before, and the other coach Latix has joined another EMEA team. One of two French orgs out of all the EMEA partner teams, Karma Corp, is looking to rebuild their roster with some French and Belgian talent in the team. The roster includes Shin, Nizira, former Team Liquid duo of Scream as the IGO and Nevera, and former, and former Mad Lions player XMS. While the coach is PM and Zelsh. Everyone else from Carmen Call from last year, Mikey and Amila, are, are on the inactive list, while Takas has joined SBG. The second Spanish org is the most clouted org alongside Carmen Corp in the EMEA partner teams. Koi, just like Carmen Corp, will be rebuilding their whole roster. The roster includes former guild player called Amenta as the IGL, former Gambit player Shados, the second guild player Trex, former Case Esports player Wolfen, and former Sen player Starzo. The coach is Guild coach Farbar, and former Oglu coach Fabino, and former KC Sports coach Gok as the strategic coach. Thor and coach Asuka are free agents, Neptuno has joined Team Questo, Fancy has joined UKM Esports Club, the other coach at Sakako and Fen has joined AYM Esports, and Sakake has joined Valiant, and Magnum has joined Apex. The only CIS team in partnership. Nana's Vincer wants to represent the CIS region in a big way with their roster, and I think they have achieved that. The roster includes four former FEX players of Angel as the IGL, Shao, Zippin, and Sagetsu, and former Sen player CNED. The coaches are former FEX coach Dawn Bros and former, and former Giants coach Latix. Cloud has left to join Giants as mentioned before, SSK has joined is Istanbul Wildcats, former coach Smart7 has joined KPI Gaming. Duno has joined Twisted Minds, Ding ZJ has retired for, from professional play, and Zeddy has joined the Ultimates. The last Spanish team in EMEA, Team Heretics, are looking to rebuild their roster around a style player for the team. The roster has Kellogg's, former G2 player Mixwell, former Sen player Zeke, former Oglu player Boo as the IGL, and a second G2 player, Avova, while the coach is former FPX Analysis, Nelzino, and former Mouse coach, Weber. Former coaches Lion Pro and Noah are free agents. While Pora has joined S2G Esports, Loa and Poppy Fresh have joined Team Queso. 
and Grabino and Snake have to join Anamio Esports. Another top team for Emiya is Team Liquid, who are looking to add more firepower to an already stacked roster. The team has Solkas, Yampi, former Gambit duo of Redgar as the AGL and Nats, and former Guild Esports player Safe. All the coaches are Emil and Bacon9 as the strategic coach. Scream and Avira have both joined the previous newly mentioned Carmen Corp, while Demisek is a free agent. The final EMEA team is Team Vitality, who was the last French team in the region, and just like most of these teams, they will also rebuild their roster around two players. The roster has Sender, Bone Cold as the IGL, former Oglu duo of Mulsey and The Strain, and former big player Twiston, while the coach is former Oglu coaches Salah, Gorilla, and Strong. Natnik is a free agent, Hydra has joined Team Questo, and Baiji has joined Ascend. 20 teams and 2 regions down. Now, let's go to the Pacific region. The Japanese org, which most people f forgot they're, they're still competing in Valorant, Destination Gaming, now called Destination Focus Me, has a new roster to work with and bring success to the team. The team consists of former Destination Gaming white player Suggest, former Reject player Retta, former North Epsom player Zinfri, the second reject player of Anthem, and former Crazy Raccoon streamer, Soldem, who returns to competitive play, and the third reject player, Take J. The coaches are former DNG white coaches, H HSK and Melophobia. The Korean powerhouse, DRX, has retained their core, who has brought them so much success over the year, with a bright rookie to join them. In the roster is Stax as the IGL, RB, Zest, Buzz, Mako, and Foxy9 as the new player. The coaches are Termi, Ardency, and Glow. One of two teams to switch from NA to Pacific is Genji Esports, who looks to challenge the other Korean teams for the crown and trophy. The roster consists of former North Epsilon player Meteor, the three former Unsized players of King, TS as the IGL, and Echo, and former Desperado player Secret. The coaches are Emil Puddy and former North Epsilon coach Bale. Everyone on their old team has left except for JC Sani, who is on the inactive list. Nature has joined TSM, Rhyme has joined the performance Giants, Snyrot has joined YFP Gaming, Coach Traumas is a free agent, and mysteriously Intro has also left as a free agent. The only Indian or global esports roster is, well, global, with the number of countries being represented in the team, a total of 5 countries being represented. The team has SK Rossi, Lighting Fast, former XSEP player Aaron as the IGL, former Dam 1 player Texter, former Onslayers player Barzi, former Order player Rongski, and former Onik player Moneyet. Cap and Skillzy are subs. The coaches are Eraser, former Mad Lions coach Spin, and Big Time. Collie and Hell Ranger are free agents. The beloved Paper Rexian hasn't changed much from last season by adding one new player who is a streamer in Thailand. The Singaporean based squad consists of Mindfreak, Forsaken, Benkai as the IGL, Devai, Jing and Cigarettes, who has played some competitive Valorant before playing for Zersha and Z11. The coach is Alex. The team which is most likely going to be last in everyone's power rankings and predictions is the, is the Indonesian based Rexicon Keon. This team has been very shady during the offseason, especially to the Indonesian talent by only signing three of them and having mostly a Filipino roster. The roster consists of Tuji, Iman, EJ, Former Boom Esports players Tabortal as the IGO and Flipsager, and former on and former Honor player Only More. The coach is former Honor coach Ewok. Nessie and Kelly S are both free agents. Coach RB RBTX has joined Oasis Gaming as a head coach. The second team to transfer from NA to Korea is T1. They have a very interesting roster which could go well for the team. The roster has Zeta, Munchkin as the IGO. Ban, former guard player and returning to the team style player, ranked player Byungjun, and former Overwatch League player for the Philadelphia Fusion, Carpe. The coaches are Autumn and Stunner. Dwyfer has joined NRG and still has joined Disguise, which is Toza's team. The only Thai team in partnership, Talon Esports has rebuilt their whole roster to proudly really represent Thailand in the region. The roster exists of former Xerxia trio of Cruz as the IGL, Foxy and Sushi Boys. Former Overwatch League player and returning and returning to Valorant, Patty Pan, former 47 gaming player Gar Garnets, and former FW Esports player Jit Boys. The coaches are for, it is former Zertia coach Zeus and Creative. 
Everyone else on the team originally has left and are free agents. Unfortunately, on the 3rd of February, Talon announced Patty Pan will not be will not be able to fly to Brazil due to surgery on his wrist. The true Filipino team, Team Secret, won't be changing much regarding the roster by adding some players to the lineup. The roster has Jesse Vash as the IGL, Dubsep, Borkum, Jeremy, former Oasis gaming player Envy, and former Bleed player Lenny, while the coach is former Renegades coach Warbirds. Dispenser is on the inactive list, while Wiz has joined Naus Esports and Fade and Coach Fade has joined Griffin Esports as their new coach. The final team in, in the Pacific region is Zay Division. This team came out swinging last year at Copenhagen with a strong third place finish and will be keeping the core five players. The roster has Laz as the IGL, Pro, Dep, Sugar Zero, Ten, and former Destination Gaming player Barca. The coach is Junior and XQQ. Retta, who rejoined the team briefly after his loan from Reject, has joined Destination Gaming Focus Me. Now finally, the two teams in China which are directly invited to participate in this event. Also, just a warning, uh, I might mispronounce some of the players' names here, so um, I do apologize for that. But anyway, here are the two Chinese teams who will participate in the first LAN event in 2023. Most people might know Edward Gaming from their, from their miraculous run in the East Asia LCQ last year and were the first Chinese team to make it to an international event. However, with the team bombing out early, the team is looking to impress everyone this year at Brazil. The roster consists of Hal Dong as the IGL, Kyo Kyo, Nobody, Kang Kang, Smoggy, and Albo who is a sub. The coaches are After and Muggle. Life has joined attacking Soul Esports. Finally, the Masters 2 Copenhagen winners Fun Plus Phoenix return to the international stage after not getting picked up for, for partnership even though they did win a Masters event last year. But this all new Chinese roster might turn some heads if they perform well. The roster includes the former ZHQ players of A, Berlin, TZH, Rudy Yu Chen, and Yuakal. The coaches are former Edward Gaming coach Nathan D and former and former ZushQ coach Bilio. Angel, Shao, Zip and Sigetsu have joined the performance in Na'Vi along with coach Dawn Bros. Artist has joined the performance in NRG and Chinese player Omega is a free agent. So that's really about it for today's video. I'm very very excited to see how this tournament goes and um, hopefully it is a memorable one for all the right reasons. So that's really about it for me. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Like and subscribe if you really like it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.